Welcome back to Underwater Math and today's Skill Builder Online Plots. I'm Celeste and we've got Oliver here to help us as well. Hey guys, today we're at the weather station to build our skills on line plots, as well as to learn about weather on Earth. What happens up there can affect what happens down here in the ocean. Line plots are graphs that display data as dots or marks above a number line. The dots above the number line are called data points. Let's start exploring the weather station. Look at this number line. The number line shows the amount of rainfall 10 cities in Texas received in inches last month. The number of cities is the frequency and each dot, or data point, represents one of the 10 cities. I wonder how much more rainfall the rainiest city received last month compared to the least rainy city. Let's plot our data first. Two cities received two inches of rain last month, so two dots above two inches on the number line. One city received two and one fourth inches, so one dot above it. Two dots above two and two fourths, or two and a half. One dot above two and three fourths. One city received three and one fourth inches, so one dot above it. Two dots above three and two fourths, or three and a half. And lastly, one dot above three and three fourths. Up in Texas, they don't receive much rain, do they? No, they don't. So the rainiest city received three and three fourth inches of rain. The least rainy city received two inches. To find the difference, we need to subtract two inches from three and three fourth inches, which equals one and one fourth. The rainiest city received one and one fourth inches more rain compared to the least rainy. What's the total amount of rainfall of the cities that received two and two fourth inches of rain last month? Two cities each received two and two fourths, or two and a half inches of rain last month. To find the total, we need to add 2 and 2 fourths plus 2 and 2 fourths. 2 plus 2 is 4. 2 fourths plus 2 fourths equals 4 fourths, which equals 1. If we add the 1 to the 4, we get 5 inches. The two cities that received 2 and 2 fourths inches of rain received a total of 5 inches last month. Two cities also received 2 inches last month. It must be hot in Texas. Sure is. Great job today Celeste and thank you for stopping by the weather station with us. Knowledge is power. Keep practicing.